Islam deprivation and ugly behavior and free of charge basic education in Egypt and the high value parents put our education of their children in Roman states are still far from the universe. Watson Foundation launched an initiative to face children's dropping out of school called Egypt is Challenge. It's totally based on volunteers to educate children from 9 to 12 years who drop out of school and to change some of their behavior around them. In this respect, we have with us today Dr. Anani Haula and the Haula, sorry, I'm very sorry, and we have with us Dr. Uh, um, uh, Mrs. Suhaila Hirshan, member of Board of Trustees, and, uh, and Dr. Anani Haula is the head of Board of Trustees of the Weapon Foundation. Thank you very much, sir. Dr. Anani, I want to, you to talk more about um, the Weapon Foundation. And um, what uh, and the initiative that the, the, the volunteers did. Okay. Open Foundation uh, is uh, an NGO uh, has a different uh, point of view about the charity work. Instead of building on uh, donations and uh, the people waiting for uh, your help and uh, your support without giving them a chance to improve their skills. Uh, we stop this uh, way of uh, thinking and we are trying to put an, another concept of the charity work. It uh, makes the, uh, uh, the person who has a need uh, more independent and more um, having uh, some extra or some additional uh, ways and uh, um, different uh, um, uh, ways of uh, thinking to change his future and to have a better chances uh, in work. Um, Dr. Anani, what problems does dropping out of basic education cause in our society? Uh, they are the, 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 the initiative of every problem you, could, you can mention of everyone. Even the uh, sexual harassment we are now uh, suffering and uh, all of a sudden discovering a, a disaster, but actually this is the, the normal uh, result of uh, ignoring, uh, uh, giving them the simple ethics about everything, starting from the childhood. Is this the Hila? As a member of the Board of Trustees in the working group, what is your initiative really about? Actually, our initiative is to save these children uh, and uh, to turn them into skillful labor and at the same time uh, uh, to empower them uh, to be independent and to be uh, uh, a good member of the society instead of being uh, beggars in the streets or even working in uh, dangerous uh, locations of carpenters or in uh, many, many uh, small workshops in Egypt, they are exploited actually. Uh, so we have focused on the children from the age of 9 to 12. Because we think that these children we can do something about, we can change the behavior, uh, we can change the point of view about life, we can make uh, a change really in those children. And, and uh, one day we are, the, the, the purpose of our initiative is to create also get an income generating for these families that send their children into work. Because actually the, the families send their children into work because they, they don't have money. So uh, we, we, we try to focus on this, uh, uh, to avoid the phenomena of three children. We have about one million, two million, three million, three million, three million children. Um, but there are many what uh, regions in Egypt did you call that? We are talking everybody needs need help, actually. Starting from the child, um, and we uh, and find the best age to uh, uh, help is for my uh, uh, I love the region, the place, the region, I'm sorry, I didn't know. Uh, the reason, uh, yeah, all over Egypt, we are joining and having our uh, project all over Egypt, but uh, we are trying to be uh, more systematized. So we're starting with uh, a prototype uh, uh, school here in uh, Cairo, uh, but actually our dream is uh, expanding, uh, expanding to all Egypt. We call the nature work with the Ministry of Education. We are trying to help as we out of different after Egypt has a legal a leadership now, a new leadership that we are all optimistic about. Uh, President Egyptian President Abdel Fattah has to see a new leader into a new era. Do you think things are going to be more facilitated and, uh, and it's going to be better um, and, and it's going to be easier to communicate with the Ministry, with the ministry of Education and facilitate what you want to do as volunteers? This is our only hope. Other 
why this country will suffer a lot because our resolution so far doesn't reach the uh, uh, governmental uh, uh, system or the uh, uh, official uh, people working in uh, the different countries. It's in general. It's the same mentality, the same way of thinking. So we are suffering a lot. But I hope this is a new beginning. If we don't take the chance, we will be in a big danger. So I know what are the challenges that you faced at the, when you first launched this initiative as a volunteer and as a member of So how to convince uh, this parent to send the children to 